Cool family, welcome to the Bean Alley Carol Vlog. I'm Alicia Fernandez, and here I'll be back again on this exciting journey to bring before you something amazing, something hardcore, like we always do. Well, as you can see, the weather is perfect today. The sky is at its best, just like you would want it to be. We started our journey from Panjim early today, and here we are on the roads exploring the scenic beauty of this beautiful place at Old Goa. Yes, so we are traveling from the current capital city of Goa to the former one. I put on the Google Maps to guide us on, and yes, as we enter the former capital city, Old Goa, I must say this place has some really beautiful churches. And well, 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 this isn't it. Today's destination is very special as it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site. As we are nearing this place, I'm all excited as this is the first time that too I'm visiting this place. All this while, I'd only seen this in photographs, and I always wanted to be here. And well, it is because of being Ali Caravan Vlogs. This has been made possible. And there you go. There it is. The Saint Augustine Tower. Oh my God! We are finally here. What a beautiful sight it is. As soon as you enter, we can see this glass with the actual church impression of how it looked back then, and it gives you a feel of how massive this church was. It is said that due to lack of maintenance and vagaries of the nature, this church couldn't withstand, and thus portions of it collapsed. All you have to do is stand before this board over here, and. Uh, Place yourself at this angle, and here you go. It looked like this, massive and beautiful, isn't it? Well, I clicked another photograph. Maybe in this video recording, it might not look that clear. So I clicked a photograph and I've edited it, and here is it. which subsequently led to decay due to lack of maintenance. This place is one of the most visited sites and now it is looked after the Archaeological Survey of India as it is one of the World Heritage Sites. These are you can see are the pieces of the poles which are, were erected at the center or the entrance of this particular church. The remains or the ruins of it is right now on, placed at this particular place. The tower is about 46 meters high, the only one third of the church which is still standing strong. As the church is at a height, the view from the top is completely different and magnificent. You can just sit down and just relax in this particular place. Also, if you take a closer look at the structure, the structure is built with laterite stones. As we walk into the church, the place is still one of the heritage sites with no roof. So when you see this place, it's an open air and the sky, as I told you, looks very beautiful today. We can witness it right above us. It was a church back then which was dedicated towards Our Lady of uh, Grace. Tower was built of the church in 1602 and that's when the church completion was done and came to be recognized as three great Augustine churches in the Iberian world. The other two being in Basilica of uh, in Spain and one in Lisbon, and this is the third one. If any, if you have a closer look at this particular tower, the tower is uh, one of the focal points of the church, and it is very impressive with the way it has been built. So the tower was basically to serve as a belfry, and the church had almost eight rich adorned chapels for altars, which uh, we will be visiting as we enter into this particular church, this particular tower, ruins of the tower and a convent with numerous cells attached to it. Now, it is said that Augustine churches are to be great churches and absolutely colossal in slice. It is also believed that it was during the Portuguese rule, all the religious orders were being dismantled and uh, 
this became a part of the same fate and the terrible black plague that spelled the beginning of the end of this one massive complex. So today, as you can see, the entire site is in ruins. You could say it's a com combination of neglect and abandonment which led to this building within the site collapsing into the rubbles. This place, even though it has been uh, in the ruins, and the huge bell which was used in the tower initially was taken to Fort Aguada in 1875 and now it sits at the Church of Immaculate Conception, the now capital of the Pancham city. Interesting enough, uh, while the Archaeological Survey of India has been carrying out some significant clearance and conservation of the site, the ruins in 1998 and 2000, St. Augustine Tavo was also found to, be to hold the precious remains of Georgian Queen Kitavan. So, it is one of those sites that we, which has usually the music festival. Kirtavan World Sacred Music Festival, which is held every year in the month of February. Uh, her remains are assumed to be kept over here in this particular place. Well, this is my first historic place feature. Well, I would love to know your feedback about this particular video. Y'all have always supported us whenever we have thought of something different, something hatke. Is baar bhi kuch hatke kar rahe hum log. We are planning for Instagram page, so that will be only possible if we get. 400 plus likes on Facebook so we are hoping that he follows on Facebook the link is available in the description below hit like comment share ask your friends to do that this is something which we are planning for a long time that we wanted to make uh, Instagram special and that would be possible only when you support us in reaching our 400 mark we've already reached around 330 plus on Facebook and we feel great when, you know, we receive feedbacks from all of you all about the different things that we do. So this is another initiative which we have taken that we'll be doing something more interesting on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. We are already there. So follow us on Twitter, Instagram. They're coming soon. And yes, it, everything of this is possible only, 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 only when you support us. So thank you so much for all the love that you all have given us till date. We are humbled and we are very happy that, you know, we are associated with you all in this particular journey. And yes, you all are the one who motivates me every single day to bring before you something different, something hatke content. When something like this happens, it feels great to bring before you something like this. I'm very excited to know about it as this is my first video. It may not be best, it may not be so great video, but I know that we all begin somewhere and sometimes it's always that what we do is something which inspires someone or the other in the down the lane which helps them do to better and that's the process of learning and I love learning. Guys, do let me know what you feel about this video. Hit a big fat like, comment below, and 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 don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Here comes the subscribe button. Well, that was it in this particular video. Keep liking, sharing, commenting. Tell let me know if there's any place that you want me to feature, and I will do that for you. And yes, yes, yes. Stay happy, stay safe. And enjoy the monsoons and well, 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 keep watching your favorite being Ali Carol Vlog.